ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the new president at Maryville College, Dr. Tom Bogart. How about a big round of applause for our ceremonial first pitches? For Maryville College, you got to welcome their brand new president, Dr. Tom Bogart. He comes by York College in Pennsylvania as a distinguished, uh, really, educational career which took him through Princeton and some other spots. I've always thought Princeton uh, a fine uh, place to get an education. My, bro my little brother was born there, too. So <laughs> welcome, uh, Dr. Bogart, to uh, Smokey's On Deck. How are you doing today? I am doing fantastic. I love being here. Well, I know you were real excited about the prospects of this year's football season as far as Maryville College goes. The Scots have had a huge amount of success over the years, and uh, this season should be no different, huh? It's going to be great, and one of the fun things, of course, is that because we're Division Three, we have real student athletes. Uh, so right. not only these people are excelling on the football field, but we see them in athletic or not only academics and uh, other types of student life as well. It's a, it's a great community type of a thing. And I agree. I've always thought that Division Three athletics really is guys that are there to get an education, not to take anything away from the bigger schools but still I mean it, it's a different type of athletic program because basically you're there to learn and you know playing football is part of that but not all of that absolutely and and again part of the fun of it is not only do the students and other community members come out to root but they're rooting by name because it's the person down the hall or the right. person that sits next to them or is in their study group so so it's a very special type of an atmosphere I know baseball is another program that the Scots have had a lot of success in. Basketball is as well. And you were telling me that there's been a ton of All-Americans and a ton of NCAA performances where these guys have taken, or, and ladies as well, have been able to take their programs to the next level and compete on a national stage. It's, it's fantastic. We have 15 varsity sports, and over the last decade, we've had roughly 60 NCAA tournament appearances. So almost half of our teams go to the NCAA, and so we're a very high quality athletic program as well as being that special academic place. Right, and for you personally, how rewarding is it gonna be to be the president and watch this first football game? I can't wait to get there. I've heard so many stories about the bagpiper coming out and the cannons being shot and the sword. It's, it's gonna be really exciting, and if people like this kind of atmosphere, they should come and check us out in Maryville. When you were interviewing for the job and you walked through campus, I'm sure that was probably one of the big selling points for you as well. We turned the corner our first time on campus and saw the mountains from the campus, and my wife and I looked at each other and kind of smiled <laughs> and nodded and said, oh, this is going to work out real well. Now, is this the first time being in East Tennessee in this area, or did you ever come here on vacation? Interestingly enough, last summer... Uh, my wife's family got together in Nashville, and on our way back to Pennsylvania, we wanted to stop and vacation, and we stopped in East Tennessee and vacation in Mountain City, hey, little go. knowing that we'd be moving here permanently very soon. And so it, this is a place we already loved, and to get the chance to, to relocate here is a dream come true. I'm sure there's football tickets available right now for the upcoming season and uh, websites, any of that kind of stuff for information? Absolutely. Go to the Maryville College website, www.maryvillecollege.edu, and, uh, and uh, look for information there. Oh, Tom, thanks for spending some time with us. Anytime. Thank you so much. That's the brand-new president at Maryville College, Dr. Tom Bogart. And a reminder, football season, basketball season, all that stuff dead ahead as the Scots look to put another great team out on the field. Thanks for coming up.